Hey, this is Dave Jacobson. I'm the Senior Application Engineer at Lambda Research Corporation. So at Photonics West this year, we're introducing the latest release of our flagship product, TracePro, with the TracePro 2022 release. Uh, we've got a lot of exciting new features with the software this year. Our biggest change is we've, we've gone to a different CAD kernel. So now we have some more capabilities uh, in the software, some nice future expansion uh, capabilities. We've added a lot of new features, things like expansions of our lens element, where we can now do uh, objects and surfaces like QA spheres, polynomial surfaces, uh, asymmetric Zernikes. So a lot of additional capabilities there. Uh, we've added a new all mouse mode that's going to allow people to use their mouse uh, in a much more efficient way, similar to like a CAD program such as SolidWorks. We've expanded our importer, CAD imports and translators, so we can now read in files from IGIS, STEP, SAT. In addition, we can directly read files from like SOLIDWORKS, Inventor, PTC Creo, CATIA, NX, uh, Siemens NX, Unigraphics. And those are all included with the software now, so they're not an extra add-on item. Uh, we added a new capability for modeling the environment where if your object is inside of, let's say, water or air or turbulent air, we can model that with using both the material properties and the bulk scatter property. So it gives us quite a bit of capability um, in terms of that. There's, like I said, a lot of nice new enhancements, a new surface source tool that gives us some capabilities of making, uh, for example, IES files combined with spectral information and a lot of other types of, of source properties from manufactured data um, and data sheets. So just to let everybody know, kind of wrap up here, we do offer a free 14-day trial. So if anybody is interested in giving the software a try or for any additional information, please um, see our website, uh, www.lambdares.com. That's uh, L-A-M-B-D-A-R-E-S.com. So thank you, everybody, and I hope you have a good day.